Rooftop bar season is upon us and it doesn't look like it's going anywhere anytime soon. Unlike other countries with four seasons, the Lion City is blessed with tropical weather all year round and Singaporean crowds are heading to the roofs to party it up in the skies. Well, barring a few rainy days and hazy nights, rooftop and terrace bars are the new pre-party venue choice. A good alternative to avoid crowded clubs and pubs, rooftop bars allow you to do the intimate chill-out sessions with friends and unwind to a great view of Singapore. In this episode of Rage, Razy TV will highlight three elevated venues that are worthy of your time. I think it's cool. It's it's, it's something different uh, besides like you know uh, all those little small clubs you have. Yeah. I mean you have such a good view. You know you you can you can have nice drinks up here and stuff. So I think it's really cool. It's it's new. Uh, young youngsters might like it. Yeah. yeah something new though. Okay, like what do you think goes behind the reason why it's so popular? I think it's I think because it's, maybe it's like a job place. I don't know. Okay. It's like yeah. Do you think in Singapore there's like a lot of rooftop bars or terrace bars opening up? What do you think of this this trend? Um, I think there's like a few. The one at Louvre, mm. for example, the one at Louvre, and then it's like it's quite a new innovation right now. So I think Singapore might come to accept this kind of concept, like yeah. the ideals of coming to rooftop bar. What do you think? Is this trend? Why do you think it's so popular nowadays? I think there's probably no more room downstairs. So that's that's the only way that's the only one place where people can open a new bar probably that's what I think. I think this is the open space is the new thing in Singapore now. Open new space bars. Maybe you can tell me uh, your opinions on like the rooftop bar trend in Singapore. What do you think of it? Um, I think it's pretty cool that you know being Singapore we're kind of claustrophobic, right? So yeah, you, know, you get a breathe here so it's kind of cool. The other thing is because people have been Sitting in the office in enclosed AC environment, so they need something you know outside to go and open and enjoy a drink. So I think this could be one of the reasons. Do you think like uh, that's the reason why Singap- Singaporeans sort of like gravitate to these rooftop bars because it's claustrophobic? I feel like that, yeah. But I think you know most people just want to change the scenery. They want more options. Yeah, probably. So Singaporeans just want to keep our heads above the concrete jungle and escape the rat race now and then. That makes a lot of sense. So what are some of your options to get some elevation? In a previous episode of Rage, Razy TV checked out the opening of Ying Yang Bar at Ansiang Road. Partners behind the new rooftop bar Godwin Pereira and Orhan Koch had this to say about filling the void of the pre-party culture in Singapore. Well, I guess most of the entertainment industry, maybe I would say, it's missing out on the grey area and that's what we are providing. You know, that whole missing bit that's in the middle with this, this whole pre-party culture and how people come out and try and enjoy themselves before they go into the club. So that's a whole segment that we are going for. So we make it work that way. If you want to come after work and come for a drink, we're here. If you want to come before you go to the other big clubs, come here. It's that, you know, it's that niche part where you say, listen, you come whenever you feel like it, you do whatever you feel like doing, and now it's all good. So what are some of your rooftop bar options in Singapore? Just a stone's throw away from Yin Yang and sharing a similar view is Breeze at the Scarlet Hotel. Not a newcomer to the scene but still possessing a captivating view of Clark Key and the Singapore River is Helipad at the Central. A definite date place overlooking the Marina Bay is Lantern at the Fullington Bay Hotel. Of course, we can't forget the original bars with a view, Louf at Odeon Towers and New Asia Bar at the 72nd floor of Swiss Hotel. Finally, opening up just in time for the F1 night race is restaurant and club Coup d'etat. The 1,300 square meter venue will be situated right on top of the 200 meter high Marina Bay Sands Sky Park. And with a view like this, it definitely is reason to celebrate all night long. But just when you think you can't party higher than the Sky Park, one altitude at 282 meters is the highest place in Singapore you'll be able to get down and party. Find out more in the next clip. <laughs>